I feel like I'm gonna be getting in my Dylan is in trouble bag for a minute here, but this is one of the rare times that I was actually having a conversation with someone on Instagram, basically talking back and forth about a few things, and they asked me if I was gonna be doing this movie at some point or another, and I literally responded to them, I might come, it might not, who knows, and that was literally two days ago, and then I decided to go ahead and do it. I'm sorry to whoever that was. I actually am gonna go ahead and watch Sing 2 for the very first time. I do think that my homie boy Seth MacFarlane is not in this, which is gonna make me very sad, but I'm excited for the rest of the characters. Can't wait to see what they're all up to. Can't wait to see what is happening this time since we had the singing competition in the last one. What's the story gonna be in this one? I don't know. I'm ready to listen to some bops. I hope you guys are as well, but before we hop into this, I ask two things of you all. Leave a like, please, please, please. It's down there. Go ahead and smash it. It's waiting for you. And number two, leave a comment of what's your favorite song from either Sing 1 or Sing 2. I definitely wanna see those down below, and let's just get right into this. Okay, Minions, get it? I didn't know I was watching the Glee version of Despicable Me. Okay, that's actually quite frightening. I take back what I said. Let's not do this. Was that the Star Wars theme music? This sounds exactly like this is straight out of Star Wars. Ooh, you know what I would love? I don't think that's what this is, but I would love a Halloween version of all these characters. First of all, why is there a giant bullseye down there? Second of all, why is everything glowing? Alice? Okay, I was joking, but is this actually Alice in Wonderland? Elephant, you and me, we gotta have a conversation. How much have you smoked before you came in here? A lot. Hey, that's my boy Johnny. He's my favorite by far. Well, outside of Seth MacFarlane, but you know, I don't think he's in this one. Oh, this was all a production. Okay, I'm just so confused. What the f did I just watch? Maybe it's good. Pig impersonating a raccoon? Is there a symbolism there that I'm not getting? I like that they gave upgrades in the fashion to both of those two, and then for her, they left the same old hoodie and jeans. <laughs> oh God, it's not the human centipede, it's the piggy centipede. No. Those runs are disgusting. And this performance will be called Drugs in Wonderland. <laughs> Two belly laughs and five chuckles. Is it a little creepy that we're all up here staring at a potential talent scout? <laughs> Absolutely. Dream big dreams. That's what I always said, right? Until the banks came knocking. What are you gonna do? Improvise. I'm not staying for the second half, so. Oh, did you enjoy the first half at all? Like, what's happening here? No, please, please, be as honest as you like. You're not good enough. Yeah, that's pretty much the entire acting community. You'd never make it in the big league. Bye now. You know, my favorite thing is talent scouts that have never actually done anything talent-wise. Isn't that the perfect irony? Anyway, about Thursday. That is nightmare fuel. I never need to see that again. <laughs> wait, 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 hold on a second. No, no, no. Oh God, I thought his fingers were gonna get stuck. That has always been a pet peeve of mine. It's when your fingers get stuck in doors and windows and bleh. You, going to you know, I will say though, you've got to be able to appreciate what you have. If they already have a sold out show, why do they need to go do something else. I mean, I can understand if it's like an individual person, but like, this is fine. Agnes, I think I've got something for you. You don't let me! You are looking like the I'm definition of down bad. I'm a failure. Oh, poppycock. Poppy hooby? One negative comment and it's all, who is me? Actors, am I right? Never mind what this person you don't even know said. Do you think you're good enough? Preach! Listen to Nana. Maybe you're not good enough. Okay, you made your point, move on. Don't, don't ruin it, don't ruin it. All right, I'm smelling a 90s Jazzercise workout video. Mike's mom, get over here. Oh, hi. Hey, my girl's still vibing, let's go. I still want her to be a part of the pop punk community though. Is that the k on little puppies from the last movie? Not letting guys like you tell me what I'm worth? Preach. Am I just saying preach this entire time in this commentary? Ah, what the f Preach! Wait a minute, you, you gotta do the encore. Yeah, pay me what I'm worth and then I might do something, Dick Weevil. There's a reason our show is sold out every night. Okay, but the question is, what do they have to prove if they've got sold out shows every single night? Someone's gonna need to explain this to me. I have dreamt of performing in Red Shore City since I was a little kid. What's Red Shore? I'm just confused. Well, you did say dress to impress. Miss Crawley, you look beautiful. You know, we're trying to sleep up here. 
Giraffe, keep your eyes on the road. I know you want to watch, but pay a ticket. Oh, so this is basically their version of Vegas. Why do they need to go to Vegas? Vegas isn't that much fun. Well, unless you're in the hangover. Um, Sir, do I need to call security? I think we can all take your one security guard. Let's get you out of here. <laughs> I smell an office routine coming out of this. Oh, Billy? They got Billy for this? Okay. You're about, about to be, to be killed, killed by a Zamboni. Wow, that is some core strength right there. Good use of the eye. Well, we're the cleaning crew. We're here to mop up. The competition, I mean. You should say the things we do. Is this an Ox version of Beauty and the Beast? Beauty and the Beast. I just have no words. What is all this? Hello. It's nice to meet you. I don't want anything from you. Go away, you demon spawn. Button. Call me on my cell. Button. 50 buttons. Little guy, you're here for the audition? Uh, yes. Of course, yes. Okay, guys, just like we rehearsed. All right, 50 chances say that it doesn't work out. This is exactly the kind of big idea I'm talking about. I'm so confused. What? You wanna uh, tell Mr. Crystal what it's called? Uh-huh. Wait, we're going off of his idea? Really? The pop punk pig wonder? I wanna tear down the You're telling me they had this whole idea built up and then they just wing it on the fly? No reach out. I'm just confused at this point. Mom, do you really know Pig Halloween? I'm not nope. Anytime I promise anything, it's a complete lie. Don't you ever do nothing to make me look bad. Yeah, because I can literally eat you. Or I'll throw you off the roof. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he's joking anymore. Is this really happening? Yeah. I don't even know what's happening. Sci-fi musical? <laughs> You're a genius. I'm going to be honest with you all. Never in the history of the world has a sci-fi musical actually really worked out. Outside of like Little Shop of Horrors. Are you telling me it hit the news that fast? There's a lot of convenient stuff happening in this one that I'm not feeling as much as the first one. Like the first one was real charming and it just had that little special spark where it was just felt raw and real. This one just feels like we're doing it because we need a sequel. Now, if the whole message ends up being like Moon is literally doing this because he is never satisfied, like a Hamilton aspect. I'm never satisfied. I've never been satisfied. That I can get down with. But if they're just doing this because they need the next big thing, that's just, nah. Don't screw up, Moon, or else. Very promising. I'm definitely not going to get thrown off a roof, am I? I'm free falling. Proceed. That's you, baby. Is it weird that they keep calling each other baby when they're not together? You are gonna play an alien warrior in a fantastic battle scene. Yes! You give me Johnny, you give me a warrior battle scene, I'm on board. We're ready to start building the rest of the sets and- Okay. That's great, I love it, but you know what? I don't even have an ending, so can you just like, do it? <coughs> so we can't start work right now. Did everybody hear that? Does anyone else need to know that he's not fully committing to this project? totally have a duet with Clay Calloway cause like why you all think that this guy is the right person to base a whole play around I'll never understand Clay Calloway? yeah I found his home address Miss Crawley are you gonna be useful this movie you home girl if you're trying to teach a non-dancer how to do perfect ballet technique in five minutes it's not gonna happen he'll rip his limbs apart and trust you're not trusting you or whatever the f*** that is Keep you um I'm sorry. What? I won every award in town. Best crying. There's a best crying award? I don't. So their idea is to make the non-dancer dance and to make the very unsociable elephant get in an intimate scene. So we're great. Oh, let's go, Miss Crawley. I feel like me and Crawley would be a vibe. I swear, if anything bad happens to her, I'm gonna lose it because I love her to death. Hello? Wow. That is a beautiful home out in the middle of literally nowhere. It was just a gift basket. Miss Crawley, please keep your one eye on the road. Oh, that poor rental. Your set designs are a disgrace. What? I'm just messing with you. You know what? You are the worst person to try to mess with me because you do make me want to shit myself. Is this like a sci-fi show? Sci-fi? You say sci-fi? Oh, everyone's crying. Is mommy gonna jump off that? Is she gonna die? I think Rosita's having like a major freak out. You know what you shouldn't do? Saying that someone has a major freak out. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, but she does look pretty good doing that. 
Oh, hot damn, she's gonna replace people. This wolf can f***ing sing. Damn, this was her dream too. Oh, Seriously, I am completely fine with this. Yeah, that's about right. You're, you're sure you're not upset? No, I, I'm good. No, I'm completely fine. These tear stains are actually from someone else. Oh, God damn it. Miss Crawley, what the f*** did you do? I thought maybe you had been involved in a terrible accident and we'd never have to see you again. Oh, that's exactly what I was hoping for. It's only when we suffer oh. can we be great. Were you in the military? <laughs> We're channeling our inner derm string. <laughs> Again, why are they going through all this? Is it a hardship dealing sort of thing or are they just doing it for no reason? Oh, I'm sorry, Cardi, where you at? How come you don't have a choreographer? But it turns out he's a massive weirdo. And also a massive dick. Well, I'm not just gonna follow some guy I don't know. To Fair. She's the one reasonable person in this universe. What are you doing? Baby, this I'm proving I can sing and perform for no reason. It's just the time I Do you hear the inner glee coming out? How do you think I'm gonna get along without you? I like weirdos. I'm not good enough for John. No, that's not what I mean. Yeah. I, I mean, you're just a giant So what do you want me to do? <laughs> Miss Crawley, what happened to your heart? And I already know, but still! Look what you just made me Perfect lose. song, just as frightening as I could imagine. What did I do to make you disrespect me? What? All right, now I'm starting to get Tony Soprano vibes from this guy, and I'm not happy about it. It's too bad they don't have a telethon for face sighters, huh? They found a cure yet? So help me! I, I, I will. I, I, I'll get it. Okay, I really don't want to be that office man. Calm down, Wolfie! But I'll be all right. Oh, can I go with you, please? Uh, oh, I want a road trip adventure with those two. Come on, let her do it. I think you're right. Yes! Let's go! Got to figure out the ending of the show on your own. On my own? Yeah, we're f Yes, sir! You gotta bring your A-game here, Miss Crawley. And I'm not talking like the apple inside of your eyeball. That Volcano okay, no. should have been finished yesterday. Miss Crawley's getting out the whip, and I love it. Who are you? Pick up your tail and wardrobe, sweetheart. You heard the lizard. Move, Move it. it. Stay off the fence. Don't listen to him. You have that bitch electrocuted too? Callaway, what is wrong with you? What happened to you as a child? Okay, she may not be able to act, but good God, that girl can sing and she can jump. What are you doing with your face? Girlie, put that back. Take that away. What did he say? He said, no. You look a lot angrier than I could ever imagine. And a lot grayer mane. Ooh, okay, Johnny, go ahead and break it down a little bit. I like it. I would love a daredevil version of Johnny. I beat you! Now, didn't you say you were gonna eat your hat? Season it up and eat it, baby! Girl, that is your fourth today. Because I really want to talk to him. You could just, like, go buy the ice cream and then throw it away. That's what we call playing into your own downfall. Did you put honey in this? And, and the Who doesn't like honey? Do you think this is what Ruby would have wanted for you? Do you think you have the right to talk to somebody about their wife that's now passed away? Or how they deal with that guilt? I haven't even heard one of my songs in over 15 years. Well, let me tell you, I'm gonna play it for you in about five minutes, I guarantee it. And I don't like honey in my tea. Well, now you're just being pompous. <laughs> Whoa. Attention! Now let me see your war face! And I have something for you. Thank you, Mr. Moonset! Can I go back to being my goofy self, sir? If I saw a show like this on Broadway, I'd be flipping my shit. That's a really cool backdrop. Captain's log! I must take care! Who's gonna teach her how to act? Anyone? I know you're gonna get eaten by the wolf, but still. I have to give the lead role back to Rosita. What? I'm just oh boy. Y'all remember my prediction from about five minutes ago? <laughs> yeah, here it is. Darling. Saying too, if you start trying to pull that up card, I'm gonna have a problem. I will say though, the animation in this movie went up tenfold. All the details, the backdrops, just chef's kiss. Bring me Moon. On a silver platter. I'm proud of Moon for sticking up for himself, but he probably should have gone and talked to him beforehand, like giving him the situation that your daughter can't act. Is your whole job just to be a kiss ass? What? I got Callaway! Let's go, Ash! Loser like you! <laughs> Humiliate me! Maybe. Do you have a humiliating complex? Better if we just put a pin in this right now. Um... A pin in me killing this guy? You need to kill me. And I'll finish the job later. He literally wanted to kill you? This is what I said. Stay in your own lane. Finds you're gone, he'll have his thugs looking all over for you. Okay. okay, thank you for helping me, but second of all, why are you working for him? I thought you were thugs. Is this just gonna keep being the same gag over and over again?
Yeah, same joke, 15 times over. Just never had the guts to make the right one. Know what I mean? I do, I really do. But I'm still confused as to a lot of what's happening right now. Put the show on behind Crystal's back. That is exactly what we're gonna do. Say what the f it's Better not be hiding in there. What are we gonna do? Callaway, can you come beat him up? We're gonna jump out that window. You said what? Nine suspects loose on the river. And they also seem to be having a great Time. So what's the whole plan here? They put on the show and then they get killed? <laughs> Come on, get up your face! Maybe I overreacted a little before. A lot. We're all good now. Wow, my dad's gonna flip. Ah, uh, that's gonna be how that they get over this is because she's now back in the show. Son of a bitch. I know someone who can protect us. Right. Yes, Johnny's dad's cruel. Let's get it, baby. Release the piglets. Oh. Me. That is just cruel. Everybody to four seventeen. Call in everyone. We all set back here. Let's go, baby. Let's kick some ass. Are we really doing this? Yeah, you better believe it. Yeah, we are, and I still don't know why. There's, There's only, only one, one way, way left to go. go. Up. That was cute to bring that back from the first one. Who mysteriously went missing long ago. If they could actually pull this off, this would be one of the coolest shows I've ever seen. Not in the animated version, but I mean in like real life. Sky full of stars. Is that the same piano from the first one? I don't care. Oh, I got goosebumps on that. Oh, I love Johnny's voice so much. If I could learn how to do that in two days, I would flip my shit. I'm your costume, now! Wait, what? Say what? Come on, stand up to your enemy here, kick his ass! You're such a cheap little Come on, Derm train this bitch up! Oh, I like this energy, let's go Johnny! Yeah, now who's the bitch? That's right, take a bend and knee, bitch face. Repeat, Crystal is on site. Alright, let's go kick some ass. Right. Let's go to work. Let's go! The bad Even if the girl can't act, damn can she sing and damn can she move. You think that you three are gonna take on three gorillas? You are a dumb man. I'm sorry, dumb wolf. Alright, Portia, I hear you. Okay, that is creepy. That is Disgusting. Very cool, but terrible. I feel like I've got 50 morts up here. He's going savage. These songs are even better than the first movie at the end with the performances. Will you bring it out this sort of spicy song with me? Mr. Crystal, I'm coming! Yeah, because that's all you can do is be a little bitch. God, those runs are disgustingly good. Hi. Um, hi. You're in the middle of a performance right now, right? You were incredible. So are you. Um, what? That's me. Don't want to hear you. That's so cool. What if they could actually recreate something like this on stage? You are such a bitch. You know that, right? Everybody's going to see you for what you are. <laughs> oh, she's going to jump to save him. Guarantee it. And then he's going to get caught. Good job. There you go. Kick his ass. There's no way he can beat you. Oh, Mr. Boone, are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, I'm doing great. Almost just got murdered. I have run. I've always loved this girl's voice. Come on, Clay, get out here. What I'm looking for. I got goosebumps on this. Haven't found. F you, that's cheeky. That's really cheeky. Come on, lion, sing it. Now, what are they gonna do with the wolf? All that for free. <laughs> or f Hey, what was that about being embarrassed? Good, he's not getting off sketch free. All right, I like it. He's innocent, Mr. Crystal. Shut the f up. I hope that you get hit by something. About a quarter. Oh, I'm surprised she came with them too. They think your show is fantastic and they want to put it on at their theater. Oh, give us a different theater? Now we're in show business. Good, I was going to ask if they were going to put her in the show eventually, good. All right, so that was Sing 2. That was a lot of fun. I will admit, I had some issues with it. I really still to this moment don't understand why they had to go prove themselves when they were already selling out in their hometown and they were having a great time and enjoying it. Maybe they just wanted to make it to the ultimate stage. I guess that's what it was, but I did enjoy the ending. I really love Callaway's character and I really love how they built that up with the wife and him performing on stage and all the different numbers that they did at the final performance I thought was really great, but I really had a fun time. I hope that you guys did as well. If you like what you saw here today, 
today and you want to see more, if you could please hit that subscribe button and that like button, I would truly appreciate it. Leave a comment down below of who's your favorite character from this movie. I would probably say Callaway for me, tied right behind with Johnny, but Callaway was such an interesting one. You give me the love romance aspect where the wife has passed away. I'm going to be a basket case. Also, don't forget to follow me at all my social medias linked down below. And don't forget to check out my Twitch where we stream every single time a new video goes live at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And don't forget to check me out at my Patreon. If you want to see the full uncut linked reaction to this and all other movies and TV shows covered on the channel as well, head on over there. And besides all that, I'll sing to you all in another one.